my name's Kim Ingleby and I'm the director of Energised Performance. This is Holly, one of my lovely clients, and you will meet Karen later. We're going to do a feature on five key exercises to get you fit for your bikini, Holly. Um, the feature will be out in Health and Fitness magazine in July 2011, so you'll be able to get that from the shops. We're going to run through the five exercises so that you know what to do, the key things to look for so you don't get injured, and how to get the best from the exercises. Also, to get fit for your bikini, we assume that you've got a nice healthy diet, that you have good quality sleep, you're not stressed, and you do lots of cardiovascular exercise. Before you've done the exercises, we assume you've also warmed up, and if you've got any injuries, then just check with your doctor before you do any of the exercises. Okay, the first one we're gonna to do today, Holly, is the scissor leg one for your lower abdominals especially. So if you'd like to come down onto the mat, Holly's going to lie down onto her back. Now what we're going to show you is the hardest exercise first, as in the Health and Fitness magazine they've printed that option. Then we'll show you an easier option if you find this one too challenging to start with. So Holly's going to raise her head up, making sure there's a fist distance between her chin and chest and her neck is nice and relaxed. Then she's going to lift her legs up and go into a scissor motion. She's going to take it down to about 45 degrees and then back up again. And she's gonna keep doing this for 60 se seconds while she remembers to breathe. Her hands will be facing upwards so she can't cheat and grip onto the mat. And what I'm looking for is that the lower back doesn't raise up off the mat and she's engaging her lower core muscles as she does that. So you can rest now, Holly. So she's relaxing her head down. Now that one is quite challenging, isn't it? It is, yeah. Where did you feel it? all across there. Going down into the lower area as well? Yeah. Okay, now if you find that too hard or you find your lower back's arching up or there's a slight strain in your neck, then the easier option is to keep your head on the mat and then Holly's going to lift her legs up straight and just scissor from that position. So if you've got increased flexibility, you can take it a little bit higher and if you have really strong lower core, then you take it all the way down to the ground and then back up again whilst remembering to breathe. But the easiest option is to keep your head on the mat and just scissor at a 90 degree angle. Okay, you can rest. Thank you, Holly. So you do that twice for 60 seconds, three times if you're feeling really good. So have a little drink, have a little pause, and we'll be back to show you the next exercise in a minute. 